clung to each other at the crash site today after a freak tragedy saw friends collide on Saturday night. You won't find a more moving argument to outlaw police pursuits than that of the Rose families. It's not normal, it's aberrant, it's dangerous and people die as a result. In an instant, the ACT's road toll for 2010 doubled. It was a sombre mood in the Cooma Monero Shire today as word spread popular Mayor Vin Good had lost his battle with lung cancer. The loss of one of mountain biking's most promising young athletes has almost been unbearable for the tight-knit community. Venues operating past midnight will soon need to pay more for the privilege and take more responsibility for getting patrons home. Thousands of spectators have flocked to the best vantage points to watch the dazzling display that was Skyfire at the weekend. In a bid to get pranksters to put down the phone and pick up some common sense, police today took us inside their Central Communications Control Command Centre. Take Pambula for instance, a local hospital a hospital threatened with closure under Mr Rudd's case mix funding system. Labor Minister Simon Corbell able to laugh off suggestions this magazine cover is a direct copy of a Greens election poster. So after a routine scan detected a brain tumour. It was a personal challenge in getting back to this point, not so much the rugby. It's really us giving the game back to the kids and, and giving them a set of rules, giving them an environment and letting them play. It was a welcome fit for a king. Congratulations. You're the millionth visitor to the National Portrait Gallery. This has been a Win News presentation from Win Television, Australia's largest commercial television network.